What is up guys? Back with another video on the channel. So today we will be looking at the Foundations 2 SBC. Now you have to complete the Foundations 1 to get to the other SBCs including Foundations 2. Uh, but this will give you a better idea on how to get chem points for your players. It is a much more advanced look at the new chem system for FIFA 23. So, we will be taking a look at three different hybrids plus a chem challenge. So the first one here called Hybrid Chem 1. It is a league and country type SBC. So we will, st so we, here at the bottom we have three different Saudi players from the Saudi league. So we will start by adding two of them and make sure it is, they're in their proper positions. We have a left winger in the left wing spot and a ceremony in the center mid spot. So if you look on the chart on the left, if you hold the, uh, <clears throat> if you hold the right joystick button, you will see that you already have, because you have two Saudi players in the squad, you will have one chem point for each of those players. Now you have to add a third Saudi player from the same league. And now as you can see, because you have three from the Saudi league, you will get an additional chem point. So each of these three players now, because they're all Saudis and they come from the Saudi league, they will each get two chem points. One for B for sharing the same country and one for sharing the same league. So, 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 let's go back for a second. So, you need you need you need at least two from the same country to get to get the first chem point, and then you need three from the same league to get the other chem point. So, you'll go ahead and submit. <clears throat> we get the broad pack there. Get that for now. So we will go now to Hybrid Chem 2, which is a league and club type SBC. So I see here we have three Everton players from the EPL, of course. So we will start by adding the left mid in the left mid slot and the right back in the right back slot. So as you can see, or because we have two Everton players, that will equal one chem point. So to get the other chem point, you need to add a third Everton player because if you have three players from the same league, in this case the Premier League, you will get the other chem point. And just like that, each player will have at least two chem points. These two have three just because they have the same nation, but that's not what we're focusing on right now. It's the fact that we have three players from the same club, from the same league, and that gets you at least two chem points for each player. So now we will go ahead and submit. Get another pack, we'll go ahead and skip that, and we will go up to Hybrid 3, which is a club and country type of SVC. So, in this one, we have to match at least, we have to match two players with the same country and the same club. So, go ahead here, and we'll add the center back. Hold the right. My joystick button and you will see we need one more Argentine player from Boca Juniors and that way because they both share the same nation and the same lead uh, not the same league but not necessarily same league, but the same uh, same club and the same country each qualifying player will get two camp points each so one camp point for, for the same nation and one camp point for the same club. Go ahead and submit. And now we will go to 10 chem 
challenge. Now there are three ways to go about this, so I've already outlined the first one. One is that you can have five separate players. They can be different, they can be, all be from different clubs and different nations. But as long as they're all from the same league, you can have, you can still get 10 Kemp points total. That is because if you see the chart on the left, so let's take off the goalkeeper for a sec and the left back. So these three alone, because they already share the same lead, you get the first camp point. Now you have to add two more, so we'll put Mendy back in and we'll put the goalkeeper back in. And as you see, see add, as you can see, once I add the goalkeeper, that's five players from the same lead that gets you two camp points each per player. So. Uh, but of course we're not going to be doing that, so we're going to... There is another way we can do this. Is we can have four different players, at least four different players from the same club. So you can have striker, center mid, the other center mid, and a left back. Now they have different nations. But they have the same club and obviously the same league. And this. So we'll take. So if we go back again, let's take this off for a sec. Take two of them off for a sec. So two players alone from the same club, that gives you first 10 points. So if we add center mid again from the same club, now we only. Now. You have three players from the same club and the same sorry, and three players from the same league. That's one ten point for the same club and for the same league. That gives you two ten points already for each player. So if we add the fourth player from the same club, he's going to get at, he's going to get the ten points as well. So because we have four players from the same club, that gives you two chem points for each player, and then an additional chem points for the same league, that gives you a that gives you the maximum three chem points for each player. So you can you can add any random player, and not he's not going to get any chem points, but it doesn't doesn't matter because the other four have the max number of chem. But what we're going to be doing for this example, we're going to use five players from the same nation. So we will go ahead and do that. Put the goalkeeper back in. Right. Two center mids. The left back. And the striker. But that gives us minimum 10. You get bonus chem because they should, because four of them share the same lead. But what we're focusing on is <clears throat> on the chart up to your left. We have five players from the same nation. So take this off one last time. So two players from Spain get you the first chem point. So if you add the other three Spaniards. You will get two camp. You will get two camp points minimum for each player. So just because, because this this left back does not share the same nation, excuse me, excuse me, he doesn't share the same uh, league as the other ones. He is in the second tier. The other ones are in the first tier. So that he does not get the third camp point. But that doesn't matter because you have five players from Spain that get, that will give you the minimum ten anyway. So. Go ahead and submit. And Foundations 2 is complete. So that that pretty much sums up um, Foundations 2. So in the future we will be looking at Foundations 3. So once we finish with Foundations 3, these, these are the more advanced ones here. So we will go to Hybrid Leagues, Nations, League of Nations. 
So, all right. So that will do it. So thanks again for watching. And if you found this to be informative and enjoyable, please hit the like and subscribe on this for the channel. And if you have any other questions or comments, feel free to drop on the comment section. And until next time, peace out. And I hope you have a nice rest of your day. Thanks for watching.